Hi, welcome to the red carpet. Today my guest is Artie Shaw, Vice President of Global Statistical Sciences with Eli Lilly and Company. Welcome, Artie. Thanks, Kathy. You know, it's exciting to talk to a variety of leaders in the healthcare industry. And so I have a question for you related to diversity. As the healthcare industry continues to grow more and more globally, how do you see diversity playing in innovation? Okay, that's a great question, Kathy. Uh, from my perspective, I think diversity is a key enabler for innovation. And let me tell you why. Uh, the way I define diversity is really very broad. It is uh, diversity of thought, diversity of experiences, obviously diversity from a gender perspective, ethnic uh, perspective, and, and many other things. And innovation, in its simple definition, if you define it as creating value for the customer or the consumer, and especially in our field in healthcare, uh, if you think about the majority of decision makers, you know what percentage of that falls under being women, whether it's uh, consumers of healthcare products, services, or making decisions, a huge majority is women. As we try to become more global and clearly go into emerging markets, what's known as the BRIC countries, Brazil, India, Russia, and China, understanding what the needs of that consumers, those consumers and customers is from a healthcare perspective is very important. And hence, I believe that diversity is really a key enabler to innovation. You know, I love the way you've talked about how strategy impacts really the consumer, and in this case, perhaps even the patient. Absolutely. So, how critical that is for the success of our companies. Well, secondarily, as a successful leader, uh, Artie, can you share a little bit of the formula you've used or the input into your own leadership development that you think has helped to drive your success? Okay. Uh, that's another great question, Kathy. And, um, uh, there are three things that I would say from a leadership perspective that has really had a huge impact on who I am today. Uh, first and foremost, I would say, is the values uh, that were instilled in me uh, from my parents when I was young by my faith. And, and those have become really the anchor on which and how I lead, especially from a servant leadership and never forgetting the importance of serving the people that you lead. Uh, secondly, I would say the role of mentors and coaches. And I've been truly blessed to have some outstanding mentors and coaches both within the company at Lilly and outside who have been there, guided me, provided me direction, guidance, uh, instilled confidence in me and were, and have been there uh, whenever I needed them to guide me through corporate America, I would say, and to even be a leader I am today. Uh, last but not the least, um, the other thing I would say is uh, leadership programs and opportunities to have and go through leadership programs both within the company at Eli Lilly and Company, as well as externally. Uh, Lilly is a company, and again, I'm blessed to be working for a company uh, that has at its core developing leaders and the amount of opportunities that are offered to each employee in terms of building the different skills uh, over the years, uh, I have to say that that has been also key. So those are three things, values, uh, mentors and coaches, and uh, leadership development. Artie, I can tell you're a continuous student of your own leadership, and we wish you continued future success. Thank you so much for joining us on the red carpet. Thank you very much.